Okay, so today I'm gonna show you how to do a blood draw. This is Dahlia. I hope the video is in the right spot, okay. So basically what you're gonna do, you're gonna stretch the dog's leg out like this. Grab with your two fingers and twist. Now right here, you can see it right here. That's the vein. So you're gonna hold this as tight as you can now, I read somewhere where you don't want to hold it for more than three minutes before you take the blood because you don't want it to um, hurt the blood. Let's see. That's better. Sit deep. I'm just going to let her go for a second while I get this needle ready. But, um, yeah, D. Good job. All right. So, stretch the arm out. Grab and twist. Um, if you're doing this alone, it's kind of hard to keep your thumb. So like a lot of times they put their thumbs right here to stabilize that vein. Um, but when you're doing it by yourself, it's kind of hard. Like sometimes you have someone else hold that vein for you or hold this part for you. Uh -uh. No, okay, we're gonna do it, okay? Nice, beautiful blood draw. Perfect, D. Good job, girl. Let's spin it around, make sure. You don't want to force it into the um, into the syringe because no, don't move, don't move. Good girl. Because you don't want to damage those blood cells. Nope, 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 nope. Don't move. Good girl. Good girl, CP. Let's see what you got. So you're just gonna let it like drip into the syringe. You got enough. I'm gonna let go of her arm so that when I take the needle out, it doesn't um, drip everywhere. And then you just you pinch off, um, you pinch off that spot so it doesn't drip. Which I got a little bit on me, but um, it's not too bad. And then I'll get some baby wipes and just wipe her off. Hey girl, or wet paper towel. Good job, Dee. Good job, you did so good. Yeah, all right, I'll get you some paper towels. And that's how you do a blood draw, super easy.